2019, I think, was almost like a difficult emotional year. And now looking back at it, it's like I wish that I could have just enjoyed that time. I'm Julia, I play bass and I sing. I'm Jacob, I play the drums. And I'm Nick and I play guitar and sing. We're Sunflower Bean and we're here today in Long Island. Me and Nick started the band in high school, so this is the house I grew up in. The basement, that's like our main operation space. With quarantine, I was with my parents in Long Island for the first 10 weeks, and these guys were in the city. We didn't see each other from March till May, and then I think once testing became more available, available. we were like, we have to figure out a way to work together. For most artists, especially touring musicians, there's a lot of like personal stuff that you ignore as long as possible. And now everyone is getting to look into their lives more deeply. Yeah, I don't know when we're gonna tour again, but what can you do? We're lifelong musicians. There's no other way that I would wanna spend my time. Right before the pandemic, I think we were hitting a really particular stride and that obviously has changed drastically. 2019, we had a very different year than this year. We were flying around the world, basically playing festivals all summer. Then we went on the biggest tour we ever did, playing shows and traveling. And this year, obviously, is the stark opposite. We knew we weren't just gonna like be outside of the city working on our band. Yeah. yeah. So we collected a bunch of donations, loaded up our van with like water and hand sanitizer and drove around the city giving it to marches and protesters, phone banking and going to meetings. When we're making art and talking about how we feel, our feelings are being influenced by the material reality of our existence. So no matter what you do, your art is going to be political because it's being influenced by the world you live in. Music is my forever partner because no matter what I'm going through, there's a soundtrack that makes it all make sense. I get a ton of hopefulness and optimism from my bandmates because you know, a band I think at its best is when you have individuals that are making the group stronger than the individual. We lean on each other a lot as friends and as professionals. It's like a very family-oriented thing because we're not gonna let each other all be sad at the same time. To me, that's enough.